Hey guys, hello. Wel welcome to our channel. My name is Wadamaya. And my name is I am Zine. I mean, we're going to do something that I think she has never done on her YouTube channel. Yeah. This is my idea. I met a young African lady here in this estate. You know what happens? She has her own, I mean, shop that she makes beggar, she makes shawarma. And oh, I'm wow. like, wow. And she's a fan of Wadamaya. So she recognized me and um, I asked her, can I order some? Because I love supporting African businesses. Yeah. And then I ordered. And when I tried it out, it was fantastic. Oh, but I don't have enough time to film. But since you are here, you're from Port Harcourt, yeah. we need to get to know her story, why she started. And hey, if you're living in Port Harcourt, I'm going to put the number of this lady on the screen, screen? of this video. On the description, on the on description box. Yeah. Please make sure you call her, order your... What nice, you call burger, shawarma. Everything... Everything nice. Everything nice. Order from her. So yeah. I think I need to take you to where she is. Okay. And she does everything in her house, you know that. Yeah. you and they don't know you so I have to bring them here so this is the lady that I'm talking about she has her own pastries is it pastries or what like a snack shop S snack shop you sound like you're based in the UK I, in the UK yeah. whoa you see so I've been talking to people from the diaspora so when I heard the accent I didn't even know you didn't tell didn't me he didn't, didn't even tell me so why you decided to return back um, my mom passed me. Oh, I'm so sorry. And I have a younger brother. He's just now. He turned like on Wednesday. Okay. Last week. So I had to sleep at home. Mm -hmm. Before. So um, you know what I want to do? Like I'm not from Port Harcourt, okay. and um, they are all from Port Harcourt. So that's why I want them to know what to do. Yeah. So that each and everyone from Port Harcourt has to order. See. I tried your shawarma <laughs> and we were literally saying that no, we gotta try this again. So you know what I did? Let me tell you. I divided it into two yeah. and then I eat one and I sleep immediately. I wake up. So when I woke up, my guy has already taken the half. Oh. Jeez. I'm like, I need to show them here. <laughs> but um, what really inspired you to start your own pastry thing? Um, I guess I've always liked to um, eat snacks generally. After my secondary school, she's sorry. shy. Don't worry, she's shy. <laughs> Feel free. After my secondary school education, so I went for, I did a catering course. Okay. Yeah. So um, that was it basically. So I was at home and I was trying to get my mind off a lot of stuff, and I will just start it. And I really like shawarma. Um, and I used to order from somewhere outside, and I'll have to pay like delivery fee. I was like, okay, maybe I can actually cut that delivery. You know, yeah. So like, I'll just leave that with the estate. So you do all the delivery for all the people living in the estate? No, not everyone. I mean, people still have their preferences. Okay. You know, some people order from the um, golf club, some people order from me, and some people order from people outside. And how long have you been doing it? Uh, last year, July. 1st of July, actually. 1st of July. And how is the business now? It's good. We have good business. Is it sustainable? <laughs> how do you think it's sustainable? <laughs> yeah, it is. Very sustainable. Yeah, um, I want to you know, branch out this year. Okay. Um, maybe reach out to campus. I'm actually been waiting for universities to open so I can set up like food trucks there. Fantastic. And um, yeah, that's basically. You know, you know what? I think I need to um, tell the owner of this estate <laughs> to let you, let everyone in this estate know that there's somebody in here who sells. I mean, um, snacks, burgers. Because I, I, like I didn't even talk about a burger. Literally, that's the reason why I put my shawarma in the, in the fridge, fridge for tomorrow oh. you know because i really enjoy the burger and i'm like no i need to do a video about you but seriously i i don't really have enough time so i need That's to bring okay. for taco based youtubers and when they upload the video they send me the link and i'll oh, post it yeah, yeah they are all youtubers based yeah. in for taco nice. yeah i'm meeting them for the first time okay. so if you are new to this channel please subscribe but um let me know you know we have so many young african women out there mm -hmm. Are looking for what to start their own businesses you know like sometimes you know african women 
sometimes some of them want to depend on the man oh they find that rich boyfriend and oh they're good to go and the boyfriend will buy me bone straight hair and, <laughs> and i'm good you know is it how do you call it is it bone straight hair? it's bone straight <laughs> yeah bone straight yeah that's it but you know you you, you started your own stuff so I, I just wanted to ask like i just wanted to, to tell me you know, we've got so many young african women out there if you have something to tell them what would that be um i'll just say to find your inner courage and just you know get started you know begin from wherever they are not minding what society thinks or what people say just do what you want to do she's saying that do what you want to do yeah that does not mean just go and wait on that man you know you can start what you want to start now You're strong I mean, enough. You're I mean enough. thank you they can start from a little you know i mean I mean, I like the fact that you don't even have a shop yet. I'm doing everything from your your house. That's incredible. You know, um, I would say, can we put your number here so that if you're living in Port Harcourt, please do me a favor. I don't know how we do it. It's by force. Like, I'm not going to even beg you that, oh, come and buy beggars from here. Come and buy shawarma. It's by force to buy all your, I mean, snacks, your beggar, your shawarma, your chips support an african businessman and um yeah it's your favorite village boy mr ghana baby this is not my channel but i've already hijacked the channel do you have anything to say yes can i say that we also do small shops we do puff puff oh okay samosa, for events also food. yes for events okay. as well um i'll just add the full menu so we have um puff puff we have samosas we have spring rolls we have turkey we have chicken we have beef <laughs> we have she has everything she has everything that's what i'm telling you you sort it like See, if I've not tasted it, like I won't come in here. But I tasted it and I will say that I've endorsed it. Okay, please do me a favor. Why am I even saying please? <laughs> hey, do, do me a favor. Come in here, come order one. And yeah, and it, you do the too, yeah? Yeah, too. Fantastic. All right. It's free within the estate, but then it's free within the estate. But what when about it goes, outside the estate? You don't have any location because of what we um, dispatch riders. Right so they tell us like depending on the location. Wow. Thank you so much for talking to me. I really Thank appreciate you so your time. Much for coming. I really love your work. Thank you so much. I didn't know you're in the UK. Yeah, I give us some UK accent. Hey. Oh, in it, in it, in it, in it. Oh that's that's all they know. Alright. So, right. We didn't ask you your name. So what's your name? My name is Chapaka. Chapaka on sorry. Chapaka on last on name. Is that so, what you use on your Instagram as well? So what's your Instagram? Oh, Instagram is saved by snaps. Saved by snaps. So yeah, you guys cut it. <laughs> so yeah guys, let's support her. Let's, you know, give her the support. Okay, that's your number. Yeah. I'm just going to save that. So yeah, we are done interviewing um, Amaka and it's a pleasure. Like, I'm so happy seeing a young woman trying to, you know, strive hard to, you know, make ends meet it's actually not easy you get to see other young girls out there you know doing crazy things but yeah she decided to you know work hard and not depend on anybody right yeah, i'm so glad that she's working so hard and not depend on someone like what maya yeah i have no money on <laughs> it's no like what am i has money he I has no it money. i have no money so she's not depending on me that's incredible so all you need to do is to support her come buy one or that wherever you are i mean you know how we do it it's by yeah. force to support I mean, follow the best, her yeah the best show must be no no oh, I, mean, wow. I mean i mean, I mean oh, I i'm, I'm telling you yeah hundred. it's not even port Harcourt. it's the best shawarma i've ever eaten in my oh, entire life oh, wow. see ha I, my, <laughs> I wish i i came with my camera guy he's there he he, he even stole my shawarma this morning so what are we going to do to him eh? what are we going to do to him uh, we have to i mean arrest him here yeah, guys, I just got back home and I'm really tired. Um, I know my face is actually not at its best state, but yeah. Um, you know, I just wanted to say some few things before ending this video. And I know that Wodemaya said a lot. He said it's all, but yeah. Starting up a business in Nigeria is really a tasking one. And 
trust me, it's not an easy one to as well. And it gives me great joy when I see um, young ladies like Amaka, you know, facing their fears, not um, minding the disadvantages attached to it, um, you know, starting up a business. You know, it's just so inspiring. And I just want this um, story of Amaka to inspire someone out there that you can do it, no matter how small. You can start from small and with time you get to the permanent site, okay? The journey of a thousand miles starts with a step, all right? So please support her by following her Instagram handle at Saved by Snacks. Saved by Snacks. I'm just going to put it on the screen and also on the description so you guys go check her out and also not just supporting her by following her but also you know patronizing her whenever you come to Portacot like you had she makes the best burger and shawarma in Portacot city guys can you be that <laughs> well anyways it's a wrap and i'm going to see you guys in my next one bye for now